Hey y'all, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm gonna to be making some garlic roasted potatoes. Before we get to the recipe, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and click on the bell for notifications for upcoming videos because I do post every week and I'm sure that y'all don't wanna miss out on those. Like I said, we're gonna make some garlic roasted potatoes. It's a really simple and delicious recipe. It doesn't take real long to get together and it doesn't take a long time to cook in your oven. The first thing that you're gonna do is go ahead and preheat your oven to 425 degrees. You're gonna take about four medium to large size potatoes. You're gonna peel them, wash them, and then I cut them in half. Now, you're gonna go ahead and then cut them into wedges. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna put them in the bowl and we're gonna coat them with olive oil and salt and pepper. And then we're gonna do our roasted garlic while we're baking these potatoes. And that's when we'll do a sauce after they're done and the garlic is roasted at the end. And these will make a really nice addition to a side for any meal that you have coming up that you wanna make a potato dish for. It's relatively simple. Like I said, you just wanna go ahead and cut them into wedges. And we're gonna to toss these really well with the olive oil and our salt and pepper. And then what you're gonna do after that is we're gonna make sure that we layer them on this pan, the cookie sheet. And I went ahead and put parchment paper on mine. You don't have to do that. If you just wanna spray your pan, you can. Now, let's just coat this really good with some olive oil. And then you wanna salt and pepper pretty generously because this is only seasonings that we're putting on to bake them. Now, like I said, if, when they come out, we're gonna do a garlic um, paste to put on top of it once it comes out and that's gonna make it really good. All right, so just salt and pepper, and then we're just gonna toss these a little bit in our bowl, just to make sure they get coated evenly. All right, I'm gonna let those sit in there for a minute while we go ahead and get our garlic roast, uh, head roasted. Okay, so you're gonna take the peeling off, and then you're gonna wanna cut the end so that the bulbs are exposed. There you go. Now, I'm just taking that off. And then what you're gonna wanna do is go ahead and put this in some tin foil like I have here and coat it with the olive oil. That way we're gonna make a little tent for this to go in and we're gonna put it right on the sheet with our potatoes. Go ahead and make sure you coat the ends of it. And then just gonna put it in here so it cooks in its own little pouch. All right, now we're gonna go ahead and get our potatoes on our sheet. And you wanna make sure you just wanna layer these so they're not on top of each other. That way they can cook evenly while you have them in the oven. Now, like I said, your oven's gonna be at three, 425 degrees and we're gonna cook them for about 25 minutes and then we're gonna take them out and then we're gonna flip them. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish putting these on the tray and I'm gonna go ahead and get them in our oven and after 25 minutes, we'll come back and show you how they're looking. Okay, y'all, we've got our potatoes out of the oven and they are done. Now we're gonna go ahead and remove our garlic from our little packet. And we're gonna make our garlic topping for the potatoes. You just wanna take them out of the bulbs, like so. Oh, it smells really good, y'all. And then we're gonna mash these down. And then we're gonna add a little melted butter and some parsley and we're gonna drizzle that over these potatoes. And that's what we're gonna be having for one of our sides today. Let's 
see, just mash these in the little bowl. Until they're soft, which they already are soft from being in the oven for that length of time. And we're gonna add in some butter. And these are gonna be wonderful. These are a great side dish to make with a sandwich. You can have it with a meal, any kind of meat that you have. You can always make a nice chicken or just a beef. It'd be great with a good steak. All right, put a little bit of butter in and a little bit of parsley. And you're gonna stir that up. And then we're just gonna drizzle this over these potatoes. Let's go ahead and do that. Just scoop it over. And that's what we're having for dinner or lunch today, y'all. I uh, hope y'all will try this recipe and hope that y'all will love it and subscribe to my channel and click on the bell for notifications for upcoming videos that I've got. And I hope y'all have a great day. Thank y'all so much for watching.